I need your assistance with a matter of a more... Mm, personal nature. It's Cicero. Ever since he arrived, his behavior's been... Well, erratic would be an understatement. I do believe he is truly mad, but it's worse than that. He's taken to locking himself in the Night Mother's chamber and talking to someone in hushed but frantic tones. Who is he speaking with? What are they planning? I fear treachery. If Cicero's planning something and conspiring with one of our own, it would be disastrous. Dear brother, I need you to steal into that chamber and eavesdrop on their meeting. It'll be no use clinging to the shadows. They'll see you for sure. No, you need a hiding place. Somewhere they'd never think to look. Like inside the Night Mother's coffin. They'll never think to check it. Who in their right mind would hide inside? Now go, before they meet, and report back to me with whatever you learn. What's up nerds, I'm the Roleplay Gamer and I like to party. Welcome back to Skyrim Special Edition. So Ron Kluger's character is starting to cause some fucking shit. He's scooping up Daedric artifacts quicker than I can scoop them up because I'm so busy with goddamn vampires and the Dark Brotherhood. The Overlord's work is never done. No rest for the wicked. And no rest for the wicked. Money don't grow on trees. But except in this case, evil don't grow on trees. Am I right? Know what I'm saying? Yo. So, uh, <laughs> he's scooping up Daedric artifacts, and that just will not do. So, clearly he's got the love of the Daedra, he's got the love of the Daedric princes. Uh, the Overlord, uh, look, let's, let's face it, he doesn't, he doesn't deserve the favor of Daedric princes, because he wants to overthrow them. He wants to be better than them, and he is better than them. You know, let's, let's call a spade a shovel here, let's get down to brass tacks. Uh, so it's it's about time we go back to our roots uh, we, we we go back to you know doing what dear old daddy I mean uh, d our Lord <laughs> our Lord and Savior Sithis uh, daddy what was that <clears throat> anyway um, <laughs> I just made that up on the spot I don't know I don't know if that's law friendly I'm gonna look it up I wonder if Sithis can have children uh, if he can that would make a lot of sense so we're, we're, gonna, we're going back to our roots here, going back home. It's time to keep calm and hail, hail Sithis. Why is it? I can say it every other time, but as soon as I hit record, I want to say Thysis. Thysis is Sithis' uh, like, little brother that just can't do anything right. He just can't seem to do anything right. Does death not come to us all? Is it not a certainty? I am therefore honored to be Doom's Herald, to play some part in a being's inevitable end. You got it. I should probably turn the HUD back on for one, I dare say. Alright, let's do some enchanting first, some disenchanting, and then possibly some re-enchanting. Uh, okay, wielding Mori's ring. She gave us a ring, that's... How sentimental do we want to be, guys? Let me know in the comments, so we... <laughs> you know what, I'm just going to throw up a poll right now. Uh, we got to keep Mori's ring, or we got to, like, unceremoniously disenchant it? Okay, pick up, pick pocket success is 15% better. That's right, I was going to sell that, wasn't I? But I haven't been anywhere to sell. No, get back, get back in there. Do it, do it. Come on, do it. Okay, um, enchantment. Oh, shit, we can put fear on shit. Oh, that's so cool. Frost damage. Fortify magicka. Oh, guys, I think we need to... I think we need to put fear on on that goddamn, uh, hang on. Oh, it's a magnitude of fear, is it? Charges. Oh, okay. Yeah, let's give it the, let's give it the business. Uh, and we'll put it on this orcish dagger, right? And we should be able to, like, give it some real business with the black star. Oh, baby. Oh, baby. Yes. Okay. All right. What are we going to call it? This is this is like the best part of creating weapons and shit. What are we going to call it? Uh, dagger of... Dagger... Dagger of... Coward Spike. No. 
coward's prick. <laughs> uh, this turned uh, this this turned R rated real quick. Okay, coward's prick is what we're going to do. I'm not going to be able to keep a straight face, but that's okay. Uh, let's craft this shit. Coward's prick. Let's do it. I don't know. Honestly, I don't know what use is going to be. Uh, we, we can use it. When are we going to... Alright, alright. I know. What, okay. Maybe... Just messing okay. with people. You know? Just messing with people. Alright, so you heard at the beginning there. We got to go deal with uh, bloody Cicero. So, let's let's go head in here and hide in the Night Mother's coffin. Let's go desecrate her corpse. That's alright. The Overlord is... The Overlord is no stranger to the desecration of corpses. You all know it. So I have confirmed that we've got amazing follower tweaks working. Coward's Brick is good to go. I just want to, can we see how it looks? Oh, baby. Oh, yeah. It feels so right. It's, oh, I love it. I love where this is going. Oh, dude, can you imagine? Like, if we're overwhelmed, we could just, like, scare everyone. That's going to be so cool. I love it. Okay, let's do this. We got to open it too? Come on, man. I mean, I feel like... Shouldn't they have a stronger lock on the Night Mother's coffin? But, okay. Are we alone? Yes. <laughs> yes! Alone! <laughs> Sweet! Solitude. No one will hear us, disturb us. Everything is going according to plan. The others, I've spoken to them, and they're coming around, I know it. The wizard Festus Crex, <laughs> perhaps even the Argonian, and the Unchild. What about you, hmm? Have you... have you spoken to anyone? No? No, of course not. I do the talking, the stalking, the seeing, and the saying. And what do you do? Hmm? Nothing! Not... Not that I'm angry. No, never. Cicero understands. <laughs> Cicero always understands. And obeys. You will talk when you're ready, won't you? Won't you? Sweet night, mother. Poor Cicero. Dear Cicero. Such a humble servant. But he will never hear my voice. For he is not the listener. Oh, but how can I defend you? How can I exert your will if you will not speak to anyone? Oh, but I will speak. I will speak to you. For you are the one. Yes, you. You who shares my iron tomb. Who warms my ancient bones. I give you this task. Journey to Wallen Road. Speak with Armand Mortier. Poor Cicero has failed you. Poor Cicero is sorry, sweet mother. I've tried so very hard. But I just can't find the listener. Tell Cicero the time has come. Tell him the words he has been waiting for all these years. Darkness rises when silence dies. What? What treachery? Defiler! Debaser and defiler! You have violated the sanctity of the Night Mother's coffin! Explain yourself! Speak, worm! The Night Mother spoke to me. She said, 
I am the one. She spoke to you? More treachery. More trickery and deceit. You lie. The Night Mother speaks only to the listener. And there is no listener. Wait. She said to tell you. Darkness rises when silence dies. She... she said that. She said those words. To you. Darkness rises when silence dies. But those are the words. The binding words. Written in the keeping tomes. The signal so I would know. Mother's only way of talking to Sue. Cicero. Then it's true. She's back. Our lady is back. She has chosen a listener. <laughs> she has chosen you. <laughs> All hail the listener. <laughs> <laughs> I do not remember that dance. My sickness, this ends now. Back away, fool. Whatever you've been planning is over. Are you all right? I heard the commotion. Who was Cicero talking to? Where's the accomplice? Reveal yourself, traitor. I spoke only to the Night Mother. I spoke to the Night Mother, but she didn't speak to me. Oh, no! She spoke only to him, to the listener. What? The listener? What are you going on about? What is this lunacy? It's true! It's true! The Night Mother has spoken! The, <laughs> the dancing has been broken! The listener has been chosen! When I heard Cicero screaming, I knew you'd been discovered. I feared the worst. Are you alright? Yes. I'm fine. Then what in Sithis' name is going on? Cicero spoke to the Night Mother, but she spoke to you. Is this just more of the fool's rambling? It's true. The Night Mother spoke to me. She said I was the one. What? So Cicero wasn't talking to anyone else. Just the Night Mother's body? And the Night Mother who, according to everything we know, will only speak to the person chosen as listener just spoke right now to you yes by Sithis and what did she say I must speak to someone named Amand Motier in Volanud Amand Motier I have no idea who that is but Volanud that I have heard of and I know where it is so I should go to Volenrood. I should talk to this man. Hmm. No. No. Listen, I don't know what's going on here, but you take your orders from me. Are we clear on that? The Night Mother may have spoken to you, but I am still the leader of this family. I will not have my authority so easily dismissed. I... I need time to think about all this. Go see Nazir. Do some work for him. I'll find you when I'm ready to discuss the matter further. Alright, guys. Dude, I I fucking love Cicero. I think I'm the only person on the face of the planet who actually not only likes Cicero, can put up with him, but actually actively enjoys his his dialogue. It's just so good. And that dancing. Like, seriously, guys, I have no memory of him dancing like that in the non-special edition. That's... That almost... Surely that wasn't added in just for the special edition, right? That would be fantastic if it was. Maybe I've just got a bad memory. That's distinctly possible. Wow. Okay. <laughs> this is this is going to be good. We're, we're absolutely going to keep Cicero around. He, Still it, here. It has to happen. What's the matter? Can't handle what I'm throwing your way? All right, so let's just get some... Look, I'm not going to bother you with... We've already done a really heavy, like, dialogue episode. I'm not going to bother you with, like, quest gathering and whatnot. We'll do that off screen, then we'll, we'll get the job done.
As it turns out, I've got two new contracts. Your first target is an orc bard named Lurbuk. The other is a vampire by the name of Hearn. All right, here we are about to deal with Hearn. Luckily, this is uh, this is pretty close. I, I think we can actually get rid of these uh, these two guys in this episode. That'd be really cool. Some nice, uh, nice, nice, solid little progress progression there. Let's get in here. All right, so it's vampire v vampire v. Well, like one of my. I hate it when people say it's like, I had a friend in primary school who'd be like, hey, you know, something v something. Do you want to verse me? Like Super Smash Brothers. Like, always, always bothered me. Um, <laughs> let's go with some Firebolt because, you know. Uh, he is vampiric. What do you think you're doing? Yeah. Hey! Yeah! Yeah! Uh. yeah. Ah. Enough! Uh. Uh. You're as good as dead. Oh, baby. Don't even think about it. You won't get away. Mercy! The Overlord shows no mercy. <laughs> oh, I can't believe you get $1,000 or crowns or whatever they're called, uh, bounty for taking out vampires. But I guess, I guess maybe they don't know that they're vampires. That's okay. Well, that was actually really easy. <laughs> I love it. I love where this is going. Uh, this probably isn't going to work, but look. I say that every time, but let's see how we go. Nope. What about Hurt? How's she doing? Nope, not. Okay. Well, we may as well uh, steal everything that's not nailed down, right? Hang on, is that coin? No, it's a pheasant breast. <laughs> There's no trap door here, is there? No. No. Maybe I'm thinking somewhere else. All right, let's do this. Oh shit, guys. <laughs> We're getting hungry out here and it's daylight. Okay, hold on a second. Let's check, let's check our stats. I haven't fed, I've completely neglected vampirism. So, does this mean the longer we go, the uglier we get, then they notice us? You'll have to forgive me because it's been, it's been so long since I've dabbled with uh, regular, oh fuck. <laughs> it's been so long since I've dabbled with regular vampirism. Um, I'm so used to better vampires. I'm mixing up what's in better vampires and what's vanilla. So I actually don't know what either of them does. I'm just, uh, I just got a, a feature set in my head. And it's just a whole whole mess. So I think what we're gonna do is like curl up here and wait out the day, I think. Okay, so as a blood starved vampire, apparently we are hated and feared, so that happened. Probably shouldn't have waited. But uh, you know what's done is done. We'll wait one more hour just to just to make sure we are in the night, even though it's quite bright out here. Didn't mean to rhyme. Frankenstein. <laughs> okay. So, oh shit, we're gonna have to sneak into town. Fuck, uh, okay. Look, what's done is done. It's, uh, it's happened now. So what are we gonna do? I feel like maybe if we go... Fear, Atronach... Um, hang on, do we, we've got Calm, right? Illusion. We don't have Calm? Why don't I think we had Calm? I could have sworn there was a... Hang on, maybe I got a book for it flames. Where did I see calm? I'm so confused. I'm, uh, yeah, that's alright. <laughs> okay, so I'm thinking maybe, maybe we, maybe we fear everyone or fury them and then also wield coward's prick. <laughs> alright, so yeah, I guess we'll Shit, so we're like public enemy number one. We need to sneak in somewhere and absolutely feed. So, who's detected us? Oh shit, oh shit. Oh fuck. <laughs> Let's go around the outside, round the outside, round the outside. Okay. Where do we even need to go? How far away is it? Hang on. Is it right? You're like. It's pretty close, right? 
over there in the center can we can we pull it off here <laughs> okay no one's freaking out yet we all good there it is there it is guys I mean as soon as we enter here it, it could be a shit show I really hang on wait wait a second we've got powers we've got yeah we definitely want that this is gonna make us invisible vampiric seduction uh, we definitely want that too let's do this finally someone comes in kick off your boots stay a while let me know if there's anything I can help you with uh, am I not invisible hang on did I read that power wrong And prove night vision. Well, why am Nothing I not in time these days? Why am I not invisible? <laughs> I need to feed. Give me a, give me a dude. All right, fine. If you gotta be like that, fine. Wait, vampiric seduction. Let's do this. Ah, keep your spells away from me. Feed. <laughs> And again, let's oh, suck her dry. Buy you a drink? Yes. Not right now. Anything new? <laughs> Still the same. <laughs> Tell you something's got to be done. When the time is right, friend. When we're sure. Something's got to be the done, all right. Wait. Let's mistake. talk about it some other time. Somebody help! Yeah. Yes. Thought oh, I heard something. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, yes, <laughs> must have scared him off. Help! <laughs> oh, so good. Your skin's as pink. Shh, guys, don't even worry about it. it was the snow? Don't you, you scared worry. of sunlight or something? Don't you worry about a thing, nah, nah. Don't you? You know what? And and I'm gonna sleep in his bed. Can I do that? Own bed, which was his. It's not gonna be that guy. No, we can't do it. That's alright. I'm just gonna hang out here for a mo. I'm gonna chill. I just killed this guy in front of everyone. They don't even know, because I'm so just oh, I'm so beautiful. Just such a such a beautiful, saucy little sneaky man. Anyway guys, thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to gently caress that like button. It needs love like everything does. Taste the game, be excellent to each other, and I'll see you next time. Roleplay gamer. Out.